what's up guys welcome back to the channel welcome back to the another video so it was a good day with ios 26 beta 2 i tested of the battery life i tested of the performance here is a lot to talk about in this video um i will be talking about the uh, battery life and then i will shift to the performance then i will talk about few more things um with the ios 26 beta 2 so make sure watch the video until the end so without any further delay let's begin the video so it was like a just 24 hour review of battery life and the performance and important thing i was always take couple of days to get stable so yeah make sure to keep that thing in mind i just got confused with the settings icon with between the clock and the settings icon i don't know why it happened so let's let me get into the settings over here as you can see setting is loading that we lowered only brightness a bit so you can see it clearly so i use 63 percent of my device today and for that i got six hours 38 minutes screen on time this is good this is decent this is better than the previous one um again it's just 24 hours i use youtube a lot and then i was using uh, instagram whatsapp tap mad watching sport a great game between england and india going on um so imessage is the other app that i use so it is a decent mess a decent screen on time i like the screen on time i have no issue with that um if I go back like with a beta one, I was I used 74% and I got 5 hours and 12 minutes with a beta one. Um that is quite bad. But again with a beta two, 63% lower percent but more screen on time, which means yes, battery life is in, in you know getting better over here. It seems they are working on the battery life, which is a really, really um good sign. So I am really happy about that. So yeah, in terms of battery life, there are improvements, so a big thumbs up for that. Um, if I talk about the performance for that, I will get into the Geekman score. This is the GPU benchmark. I am not happy with the GPU benchmark. Um, it is quite low. It is 26,633 on a single core. And if I compare it with the average one, it is lower than the average one. I know it will get better when I run the test again because it's just 24 hours again. Um, but I ran two different tests for the CPU benchmark this time around. The first time I got 3,332 3, on a single core, while 8 for 1 to a multi-core. Single core is higher than the average one, multi core is also way higher than the average one. So, first time I got decent scores, I used my device for a couple of hours, that's it, out this again. But this time scores were quite low 3138 on a single core, 8146 on a multi core, as you can see the difference between over here. Both scores are like single core is lower than it's slightly higher than the multi core is higher than the average one, but a single core over here is lower than the average one. But again, it's just 24 hours. These are not the final words. These are not the final words. The performance, I know, I believe it will get better. So that's the one thing. That's all about the battery life and the performance. Few more things I want to share is like um, if I am into the photos app, now there are more animations that are updated. I want to, you know, give you a perspective of beta 1 and beta 2. So over here, this is beta 1. This is beta 2. Okay. So when I tap over here, you can see the bottom tab just appears. There is no animation at all, as you can see. But on the beta 2, there is animation. If you, you know, see it clearly, try to focus it on, there is a very cool animation. That is one thing that is over here with the beta 2. Also on the beta 2, I received this message a couple of times when I'm unlocking my device. I'm getting yeah, your system experienced a crash. So I'm, you know, getting this message. I just saved it a couple of times. This is like, I didn't crash, but still I am getting this message. So I just took a screenshot of that to show you guys. Also, when you are on your home screen and you tap on the edit button over here, this is a new animation. Let me show you again. This is a new animation over here. If I show you the beta one animation over here, as you can see, this is the old animation so this is beta 1 animation as you can see and this is the beta 2 animation i like the beta 2 animation even more so this is another change so yeah there are like slight changes in the ui you know if i found any other change i will definitely be sharing with you guys but so far things are decent things are nice um i did a full-fledged video in which i talk about what is new that video is also available on the channel um, if I go to edit button over here, add a widget over here and just try to find the music app. Um, let me, you know, I'm not sure. Okay, here is the music app. Now there is a new widget of 
um, live radio. So no, I'm not able to show this one because I don't have Apple Music in my country available. But there is n this new widget of live radio. So that may be useful to people who just, you know, want to use. Also, one thing I noticed, like control center, you know, it's like the blur is increased. I know that. But it's it don't feel that much glassy anymore. How much, you know, this glass, this look, glass looks nice. But over here, blur was very low. Um, But over here, blur increased. But, you know, it don't feel like a glass. That is one thing. Um, also, there is thing that people are talking about that when you go to the lock screen, and uh, you will see the you know glass effect on the hair whenever I change the wallpaper. As you can see, it looks nice. Let me go to the colorful wallpaper. As you can see, so yeah, that's another change with the beta to Vegas. So yeah, that's all with this video, a 24 view video. Um, I talk about the battery life, I talk about the performance. I hope you like this video. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, if I talk about the future, like beta 3, we are going to get beta 3 um definitely after two weeks. So my expected date for the beta my expected date for a beta 3 is 7th of July. I am expecting another beta on this day, and I will be like expecting public beta one on 14th of July. This is what I believe. So yeah, I'm pretty excited for that. Are you excited? Let me know in the comment section below. I hope to get you guys in my next video very, very soon. Um, there are you know a lot more to talk about, so I want to talk about in separate videos. So I will see you that for in my other videos. Until then, take care. Peace out.